All right, this year's Super Bowl, guys, makes the first Super Bowl ever where the two starting quarterbacks are black, and it's also the youngest two, fa two youngest uh, combined ages of starting quarterbacks ever. Why is this, this significant of these two things? Well, I love it. I love it that it's the, uh, it, the, it's the first two Super Bowl where you line up two black quarterbacks against each other. And frankly, this is about the first time I've heard it being brought, which I think is great because we've gotten to the point as football fans and as a football society, if you will, where it doesn't matter. The, the color of your skin doesn't matter what position you play. And yeah, am I desirous to see a black quarterback face off against a black quarterback in a Super Bowl because some moron said something stupid about Donovan McNabb years ago? Yep, you betcha. Because it helps to blow up those stupid, racist, and bigoted stereotypes that need to be blown up. So having these two guys go out there is great. Not to mention, they're awesome players. It's not that they're gifted athletes. They're smart, cerebral players that don't make mistakes. So I think it's great. And the fact that they're young, bring it on. All the young quarterbacks in the NFL right now, my God, there's a tremendous crop of talent when it comes to that position. I think two black quarterbacks is far more significant than their age. I don't really care about their age. But by my count, there were 20 non-whites that started a quarterback this year, although over 60 players did start. It's, it's great to see us moving towards equity and, as you said, color of the skin being eliminated. I mean, but the, the, the elephant in the room is the coaching situation. Yes, and, that's, and that, that needs to be get sorted out because it, it still feels like we have a ways to go there. Yeah, both are significant. Obviously, the one about two black quarterbacks starting for the first time in a Super Bowl is more significant because people, whether they want to admit it or not, subconsciously still some people think that a black quarterback can't throw or it's just more of his athletic ability, things like that. Jalen Hurts is still, he's obviously a great runner, obviously. But A.J. Brown just had a career year, the best year he's ever had as a receiver with Jalen Hurts as his quarterback. The man can throw, I think, doesn't mean you're racist. I think subconsciously still people in the you know fans, media still kind of think that way, and we got to get rid of that. So that's significant. The, the young quarterback stuff, the age-wise, it's great. We're just ushering a brand-new era. I mean, we just saw Josh Allen, Joe Burrow, you know, Justin Herbert. Rodgers is on his last legs. You know, uh, Brady just retired. Yep. Drew Brees, Manning, all that stuff. So new era, new excitement of football.